Hi, my name is Selin, and today I'm going to tell you about an awesome book called Roger Goose by Jeff Kinney. This will be the best book you'll ever read, especially if you have an awful annoying brother like Greg. Greg is the median child from the happy family who always gets the fault on him and joke by Roger. Well, Mom wants to solve this problem by creating special money called Mamba. Will it work? Can Greg deal with Roger or will he give up? To know what will happen next in this awesome book, go to the library and check this book out. Hi, my name is Rosanna and I'm going to talk about a really fun book, I Got the Ferret and the Mushroom Boy, written by Kaitan Poskis. The characters are Agatha, her brother, her sister, and her father. My favorite part is when her brother puts a finger in the cake. You should read this book because, uh, because you, you'll learn a lesson about how brothers and sisters fight for nothing and no one wins. Bye bye and read the book! Hi, my name is Andre, and I want to tell you a book, uh, uh, Dragon Ball Z. It's about uh, people, uh, people uh, going out and and uh, having to find seven Dragon Balls. Uh, if if they have all seven of them, a dragon appears and and uh, they it grants any wish. The main characters are Goku. Gohan, Piccolo, Yamcha, Kuar, and Olong. Thanks, bye. Hi, my name is Anya, and I'll tell you about a cool book. It's called The Shadow Children. It's about a boy named Luke and how he's their child. He has to hide because in the setting of the book, the government only allows one or two children. But his parents don't allow him to do things his brothers do. So he decides to go to to their neighbors, where he finds another third child. And the other third child is a girl. Her name is Jen. She wants to be free, and she made a rally. A rally is a day when all third children go to the president's place and protest for freedom. I hope you read this book. Hi, my name is Jen, and I will go on to tell you about uh, an awesome book. It's called This Hotel is Hunter. This book is about a ghost in, in a hotel and it's really fun. In the book there is an Iceland called New Mouse. And in the Iceland there is mice are living. When you read the book, you're feeling like you're in the book. But sometimes the characters make make you adventurous. This book is by James Sutton. Bye bye. See you later. Hello, my name is Carolyn, and I want to tell you about a good book that I read called The Renegade by Terry Farley. It is about a girl, Sam, who lives on a ranch and teaches a neighbor's daughter how to ride. One day, there's a rodeo contractor that comes to town and wants to buy horses from Sam's dad, but he does not want to sell any horses. Slocum, the neighbor, catches the phantom one day, and Sam is convinced that she has sold him to the rodeo contractor. She doesn't know how she will find him, let alone set him free. Some of the characters in this book are Sam, her dad, her grandma, Slocum, the phantom, and the rodeo contractor. I think this is a good book, and you should read it. Hello, kids. My name is Christian Power. I'm here to tell you about a book called Epos the Flamebird by Adam Blade. The, the characters are Tom, Elena, Storm, Silver, and Epos. The plot is, Boy must save his kingdom from a powerful bird called Epos, the flame bird who is under an evil spell, spell by an evil wizard called Malvel. <laughs> um, I highly recommend this book to you kids who are watching this because it has very good action and mind-flipping adventure. I hope you like this re book report. Bye. Hi, my name is Aluna and I want to tell you about a great book that is called The uh, Diary of a Woman by Kid Rogers Rules. The book, uh, the book, the book uh, was written by an awesome author, Jeff Kinney. The book is about how Greg is not popular in school and he wants to. So he asks his brother Roger. So he asks his brother Roger and he tells him some rules. One of the rules is that uh, he has to be rude to his parents and uh, and. And then Greg uh, ignores him, his parents. I, I recommend this book because it's so funny and it has sense of humor. Hi. Hi, 
I'm Imre, and I want to tell you about this cool book called Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. This book is written by J.K. Rowling. It's a series that has seven plus two books. There are three main characters. They are Harry Potter, Ronald Weasley, and Hermione G. Granger. The best part in the book for me is when Ron and Harry were trying to catch the train to Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. And then they t and they crashed to a tree with a car that flies. I recommend this book because it's really fun. And bye. Hello, my name is Evan. I'm going to tell you about a book called Best Friends by Jacqueline Wilson. This is what happens in the book. Alice and Jim are best friends. Alice will have to go to Scotland. When Alice will have the goodbye party, they will try to run away, but they will get caught. After a while, Gemma's grandpa will take her to Scotland, and there she will throw a cake on Flora, which is Alice's best friend. Then Alice will mail her. We will be best friends no matter what. Thank you for listening. Bye. Boys and girls, welcome. My name is Gagi, and today I will tell you about a book called Storybound. It's about a 12-year-old girl named Una Fairchild, who spent her life bounced from one place foster home to another, goes to her school library uh, as usual, and one day finds things strangely different. She's suddenly transported to an adventure in progress in which Lord Peter, a young hero on a horseback, is traveling with a snowy rose whining, a whining maiden, whom he soon compelled to defend against the fearsome dragon. This is Una's introduction to the land of story where everyone's career is to be a character in a long defined tale, a hero, a lady, a sidekick, a villain, etc. Her average arrival has a disrupted examination in progress before long. She's at school with Peter Snow, the maiden, Sam, the talking cat, who is the bully, and other students, and discovering that the school, uh, the teachers, and the land of the story itself offers unexpected wonders, mortal dangers, and disturbing hints about Una's own origins. I really recommend this book to you because it's very interesting and has a pinch of power that leads the reader deep into the book. Bye! Hi, my name is Colin, and I will tell you about the book that I will to kid one. It's by Jeff Kinney. The characters in the book are Mom, Dad, Roley, Roderick, Grandma, Greg, all classmates of Greg, and Manny. All the characters were interesting, but Greg made me feel lazy. The book is about a kid called Greg who tries to be the coolest in class, but he always fails. My favorite part of the book is when Rolly eats the rotten cheese from the playground. The book is full of funny scenes. If you read this book, you will learn how to get out of trouble and treat parents and teachers. I love this book. Hi, I'm Lisa. I would like to tell you about this awesome book, When Hitler Stole Think Crap. Anna and her ma brother Max move all around the world because they are Jews, and Hitler is the president of Germany. The book is actually scientifically correct because, as the saying says, if you forget your past, you're doomed to repeat it. It is also a brilliant book because it is full of juicy and specific details. So if you'd like to read the book, then go ahead and check it out, When Hitler Stole Think Pink Rabbit. Hey, my name is Masha. I want to tell you about the funniest book that I read. The book is called Dear Dumb Diary, the sixth one. The author of the book is called Jim Benson. The main characters are Jamie, Angeline, Isabella, Mom, and Dad. All of those characters made me laugh. The book is about a girl named Jamie that is happy that foreigners are coming to her school because she loves people who aren't from where she lives. She thinks other people too don't like where she lives. To find more details, you need to read the book. My favorite part was when Jamie and Isabella saw, uh, saw their classmates' bottom. It's my favorite part because they were so freaked out and it was so funny. I also learned that the word for foreign. I recommend it because I'm sure it's going to make you laugh because it's so hilarious. So you know, so you know, it's not only for boys, uh, for girls. Uh, it's also for boys because um, the boys can learn what a girl likes and what she doesn't. Now bye, and I hope you read the book. Hi, my name is Nina, and I'm going to tell you about a really funny book. The book is called The Twins. It is written by Roald Dahl. 
They are Mrs. Twit and Mr. Twit. Their pet is Rolly Polly Bird. They are two humorous people that do silly pranks on each other. That is why they are a little weird. My favorite part of this book is when Mrs. Twit puts worms in Mr. Twit's spaghetti. Mr. Twit is really easily fooled. Read this book to find out more. Bye! Hi, my name is Ross, and I'm going to tell you something of a book. The book's name is Dare the, Wh Dare the Wimpy Kid, Roger Cruz. This book is a kids and teenagers book, from 8 to 12 year olds. And the characters are Roger, Greg, Rowley, Manny, Mom, Dad, and Roger's friends. Roger, Greg, and Manny are three friends. Their mom and dad go on vacation with Matt. Greg and uh, Roger are alone. The brother's dad said no parties. So Roger calls all his friends and had a party with Greg and Rowley. Rowley is Greg's best friend. Roger took pic pictures and forgot to delete them. Then the parents saw the pictures on the camera and they had guessed when they saw the pictures. Roger and Greg went to the mall and pranked people. Roger got detention, so he was supposed to perform on the talent show, so he won. The talent show winner gets a thousand dollars. So if Greg performs with Rowley, Roger can perform too. So Greg does the performance and Roger performs. This book is my favorite and best movie. I read this book five stars. I recommend this book to people who like comedy. Hi, my name is Beth and I will tell you about the best book. But it's also weird. Anyway, it's called The Thirteen Ghosts by Geronimo Stilton and Cripella von Kacklefer. The characters in this book are mine. And they are Geronimo, Cripella, Bitwing and Billy. So the story of the book Cripella has to write a scary story about the ghost. She asks Ger Geronimo for help. Find out what happens next. Read the book The Thirteen Ghosts by Geronimo Stilton and Cripella von Kacklefer.